felt strongly to repost this word, this morning. In the dark night. This is your revival. Over the past few weeks, I have seen the dark cloud that has come against many believers. Many who are not feeling themselves and areas of pressing causing despair. The Lord spoke to me recently about this dark place that many are finding themselves in and he said, in the dark. This is your revival. At first, I didn't understand what he meant, because the darkness I was seeing many facing, and this cloud was so heavy, but then I understood. In this darkness, in this moment of confusion, in this moment of despair, all not sent from God, but from the enemy to stop the people of God from moving forward and the new day and ground that is before them, the greatest encounters and revival they have experienced is about to take place. Where many believers are feeling like they are in the most pressed or dark or dry place, they have continued to cry out to Jesus in the midst of the hardship, Jesus is about to show up powerfully and those pressed, dark and dry places about to turn to the most fruitful and fire of revival-filled places. Don't look around you at your circumstances. Keep your eyes lifted to the one from where your help comes from Psalm 121 1. Where this heavy cloud has come and is screaming despair and death, the fire of God is coming in power to bring revival to those places. I could hear the cry of many believers, Jesus help. I don't think I can do this anymore. I don't think I can make it through this. My heart is full of despair. I am depressed. I am discouraged. The night is suffocating me. In the midst of those cries I heard the Lord say, Take heart, I am here, in me. Revival is here. What is attempting to stop you in such force, the relentless onslaught is about to turn, and you are about to know the fire of revival, the very power and presence of Jesus bringing revival like you have never known. I saw the dark night of the soul many are walking through. It was so dark, so heavy and so hard, but I want to encourage you, do not lose hope. You may feel like you are falling apart, but hold on to him, for he is putting you together. I heard a loud voice booming from the heavens with a declaration that could crumble mountains. The greatest revival of your life is upon you. You are not only going to be set back on your feet and restored, but set on fire more than ever before. I am birthing my burning ones in the very night that the enemy was using in the dark night of the soul to attempt to kill them and take them out. You will not be taken out, but be catapulted with fire. I kept seeing a sunrise, the dawn of a new morning, and as I looked around there was fire everywhere. The fire was shouting revival. 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 The areas of the heart, soul or circumstances that look like they are dying or have died, hold on, for the fire of God is about to bring it to life. You will not be marked by this dark night. You will be marked by fire and move forward into not only a new morning of promotion and opportunities, but carry the fire of God like you never have before. Look at your circumstances with the eyes of the Spirit not swayed by impossibilities or dead ends, look at them with the eyes of Jesus and see that even in the darkest night, and heaviest of pressure, he is about to trump the enemy with his fire. You're being revived.